Robotic surgery has only been around since the early 2000s, but in certain fields it's already overtaking traditional open surgeries. It's really a combination of, of patients wanting to get better quicker and to have these less invasive procedures and the technology being around to allow that to happen. In the past, surgeons made large incisions just to reach the organs they needed to operate on. It meant big scars and long recovery times until high-tech robots like the Da Vinci system at Health Park changed the game. There are two components to the system. First, the robot itself. The Da Vinci robots have four arms. The center arm holds the camera. Then there's a, two left arms and one right arm. Separate from the robot is the surgical console. The robot captures the surgeon's movements, then carries them out. This allows for much less tissue damage, much more, um, much more better dexterity. Gynecology is one field which is embracing robotics. In the past, certain women who were overweight or had a lot of scar tissue were not candidates for minimally invasive surgery. But now, using the Da Vinci, we have the confidence to do these surgeries on these high-risk patients. Monica Martinez chose the robot rather than the knife for her hysterectomy. Surgery is very scary, and this one was the best because of the recuperating time. I was in the hospital one night. With technology at their fingertips, surgeons are delivering maximum results with minimal impact. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.